So hi guys, um, welcome to my next video. So today I'm going to be uh, telling you about uh, me and my husband are getting ready to go on a um, uh, all potato diet um, for about a week. Uh, I've been, been thinking about this, we've been talking about this for a couple weeks now and we just finally decided that, you know, today it seems like the right time right now to go ahead and uh, try it out. Um, there's been a, quite a few people that I've, I've read about. Uh, so, um, in the past, I've done um, Banana Island twice, which is you eat nothing but bananas. I've done that twice. Um, I had really good results from it, um, really high energy. But I just thought I'd try, try um, change a little bit of pace and try potatoes instead. So, uh, I, want you guys wanted, I wanted to tell you guys also that I'm going to be doing like vlogs and uh, keeping you guys updated. Uh, probably not every day, but almost every day. Just to keep you guys updated and uh, show you how I'm doing and stuff like that. And the different types of recipes I'm making. be varied. <laughs> it's not varied very much. It's just potatoes. But you can do a lot of things with the potatoes. Um, so I wanted to tell you guys a little more information. If you think this is a really weird, really unhealthy diet. I want to just give you some... Uh, I'm going to be uh, telling you guys a little bit here in a little bit. Um, different uh, the health benefits of uh, doing all potatoes. Um, so let's get started. Okay, so right now I'm on um, a website called 20 Potatoes a Day. Um, this is about this guy who uh, ate, 20, ate 20 potatoes a day. Um, I think he was a yeah, Washington, uh, Washington uh, farmer, a potato farmer that ate uh, 20, 20 potatoes a day. It's pretty interesting. I'm going to put this website down below. So this is his, uh, uh, when he started weight, starting weight. It's 197. Six, uh, 60 days. 176. Uh, blood pressure, or sorry. The glucose, uh, blood glucose is good. You know, cholesterol dropped a lot. Um, also, he added no oil, no fat. It was just potatoes on this. It has some pretty good videos here too. I'll post um, his videos in the website down in the description box. Okay, so here um, I am uh, still on the 20 potatoes a day uh, website. And here's all the, um, the the benefits of potatoes. Everything that's in the potatoes: uh, vitamin C, B B6, potassium, fiber, you know, copper, iron, everything else like that. So the average potato tent, uh, the average potato contains uh, 110 calories. That's actually a little more than bananas. I'm actually surprised about that. Um, when I was on Banana Island, I was eating about 40, uh, 40 bananas a day, on average. But so if you eat, um, so eat 20 potatoes a day, it'll put you at, yeah, <laughs> 2,200 calories, which is still kind of low. My opinion, but anyway, here's all the ben health benefits um, of potatoes. I just wanted to show you guys. Um, this is the National um, Value of Nutrition, uh, Human Nutrition. This is on the Con All Potato Diet. Uh, this experiment done, uh, I think in the 20s, yeah, 19, no, sorry, 1927, about uh, this couple people who are really active. Um, Really active, they put them on an all potato diet. diet. Um, not really sure how long, but this here's the brief history of uh, some Poland, um, and Poland and um, Russia lived on potatoes. So quite like three four pages here. <laughs> so the um, you know, not really sure if they were from Poland or from the U.S. or where they were from, but. Anyway, so the two tub two subjects were healthy adults, man age 25 and the woman's 28. Um, during the diet, they did lab did lab work. Uh, they engaged in various sports, and a diet consisted of potatoes, supplemented with pork and butter fat. I really don't think that pork and butter fat. Uh, I don't know why they added those in. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, with addition to fruit, a couple of fruits, tea, and black coffee, we really don't need to have the pork 
butter fat, pork fat and butter and sugar and coffee in this diet. I think they're just adding that just to, I don't know. <laughs> it's not necessary, I think. So, uh, the potatoes were either uh, key, uh, steamed, cooked, and unpeeled, and consumed with butter and salt. Which, like I said, you don't need the butter and salt. They're sometimes mashed. With that. So I thought this was interesting. Um, during the body weight is maintained during the whole experiment. Um, the male subject, at the end, towards the end of the experiment, lost some weight. They said it's because of the intervert more higher training or something like that. But I think they would have lost a lot more weight if they wouldn't have had the butter and salt and the bacon fat and all that kind of stuff. So I think that if they would have just left those out then they would have seen some weight loss. So they also said they did not tire from the potato diet and they have no cravings for change. So they could have just stayed on there. They didn't they didn't have any other cravings for anything else, which is pretty amazing. And if people think, oh, I'll get too tired of it. But when I was, um, I was on my, the banana island for about 15 days, and I didn't want anything else but bananas, <laughs> even after I came off of it. So that this makes sense. It's so pretty much, um, no nope, body weight, um, every body weight, stuff like that. The summary, everything seems normal. Um, they didn't didn't want to get rid, didn't want to stop the diet and everything else. I'm going to post this link in the description box too so you guys can read up on it a little more. So here's what uh, Dr. Uh, John McDougall had to say about the potato. I mean there have been populations of, of tens of millions of people who had no choice but to live on all potato diets. At the turn of the century between the 1800s and 1900s in Poland and Russia that's all they had was potatoes. There have been many populations of people who have lived on, soul, on diets solely of starches. Not only out of choice, but out of necessity. <clears throat> All right. So the strongest argument I have for you that the right diet for you is a starch-based diet is the following. And that is that all populations of trim, healthy people throughout all verifiable human history obtain the bulk of their calories from starch. All large, trim, healthy populations of people, okay? All. You start thinking of exceptions. All large populations of trim, healthy people throughout all of verifiable human history obtained the bulk of their calories from starch. So um, it's as for eating as many potatoes as we want, <laughs> We're going to um, also be drinking, um, this is for me and my husband also, we're going to be drinking about a three, three, three liters to uh, four liters of water a day and uh, exercise. And maybe a couple pieces of fruit here and there just to give some little bit of variety. So that's what we're going to do. I um, hope you guys stay tuned for the videos. Um, I'm going to be planning to do this for a week, but it may turn into longer than that. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments or anything else like that, um, please post them behind uh, below the video. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share and everything else like that. So I hope you guys have a good day and I'll see you guys in the next video.